The whole point of breaking lines is to try and advance your possession with your team in a progressive manner. In today's video, we are going over breaking lines for center backs. But what does it mean? First of all, let's understand what lines are. Lines are what's created from the opposing team's formation. As a center back, your objective is to pinpoint and break these lines. It could be the attacking line or the midfield line. Basically, breaking a line means that you're passing between two players like you see in this clip right here. The whole point of breaking lines is to try and advance your possession with your team in a progressive manner. Obviously, it's important in which the player receiving the pass has a good first touch, the direction that they take that first touch, or where they are positioned on the field. In these clips, you can see different scenarios in the midfield, in the attacking third, in the defensive zones, how breaking lines can create opportunities in this specific clip right here we can see that this center back breaks lines one two attacking and midfield lines and then generates an attack for the team here an opportunity is made and this is what breaking lines can produce for your team in this clip right here we can see that the midfielder does not check their surroundings and does not allow for this line breaking pass to progress Instead, they take a touch and play out sideways instead of playing forward and continuing the play. This is really important for you as a center back to be able to let your teammates know whether they have time, whether they have time to turn, whether they have a man on, whatever the case may be, make sure that you communicate that to your teammates. Here in these next clips, you can see how as a center back, they push up the field and they continue to break lines to create attacking opportunities for the team. Keep in mind that not every single pass that you make that breaks a line is going to generate an attack, but it can help the team keep possession and move the opposition out of the spaces that they're already in. This is going to help and allow for spaces to open up, but it's important for you to identify those moments.